Hello, I'm Dal Bartling, and I certainly hope that you and yours are today going to enjoy a brighter summer day. The older I am, the more that I think, and I think of a particular resource, and this resource is getting more scarce, it seems. And collectively as a society, we look for ways that we can then get more of this resource. And yet it is such a valuable resource that we, we squander it. We do. Each one of us, I do very much so. And we're looking for ways then to use that resource. The resource I'm thinking of is time. Yes, time. You know, we find all different ways to keep track of it, don't we? Right down to the millisecond. But yet, we squander it. Yes, we do. I, as I said, uh, particularly, I'm one of them that, that, that does that. Now, I'm sure you've heard of some different sayings, and like, like, time is money, see? But here's some that maybe you haven't, and they give us time to take time and give it some deep thought. Here's one. Life and time are two of the best teachers. Life and time are two of the very best teachers. Now, life teaches us to make good use of our time. And maybe as we get older, maybe we use it a little better. Sometimes not, but maybe a little bit it helps with so-called experience. Now, I said life and time are the two best teachers. Time teaches us the value of life. Sometimes we get woulda, shoulda, coulda. Mmm, if I only woulda, shoulda, coulda. Here's one, and I hadn't heard before, but not many words, but they really come to home. Listen to this. You're never going to have more time in your life than right now. Makes a statement, doesn't it? It, it does to me. So what are some different ways that, that you found to save time? Here's a phrase on time, and maybe you've heard it. When I get around to it. When are you gonna do this? When I get around to it. How about that? When I get around to it. Well, if you use that phrase, we've got something that's an aid to you. A help. A self-help. You see, we have this here. Now, it's round, isn't it? Okay. And in the middle, in these big letters, you've got here the letters. You might want to write it down. T-U-I-T, T-U-I-T, to it. I've got a round to it. So when am I going to get to that? Well, I'm going to get a round to it. I now have a round to it. There's no excuse for me not to use my valuable resource of time and get that done. Now, this may not be a tool that you want to use. You may be want to use in your phone and all kinds of things. But believe me, being a, a kid growing up in the 60s, I think we very much were as enamored with and kind of fantasized <coughs> and had different fantasies about time and so forth. Here's what I mean. Listen to some of the titles of these 60s songs. Time Has Come Today. The Chamber Brothers. Time is on my side, Rolling Stones. Time of the season, the zombies. If I could put time in a bottle, Jim Croce. 
There's a time for every season. Huh? The birds. All those dealing with, with time, like I said, it kind of had a little uh, effect on us, I think, as 60 kids, of time and how it was going so, so fast there. But here's a tool. I'm getting into that. It's not the phone. It's a tool that uh, I think you're going to find very useful. I first used this tool when a disaster hit our family. You see, approximately 45 years ago, a tornado totally destroyed our home. Not only our home, but a lot of homes in the small little town of DeSoto, Iowa that we lived in. And all of a sudden, this very young <coughs> family had to cope with that. And you had different elements wanting use of your time. And so one of the resources that I used, and I can't tell you who really taught me, but I started to build file folders on each particular project, element, whatever it might be, whether it be dealing with the SBA, whether it be dealing with the uh, bank, whether it be dealing with the insurance company. All of those had a separate little folder, uh, whether it was uh, looking for a new home, uh, buying a new home, uh, whether it was finding a large sum of money and uh, turning it in to the authorities. All of those I built a little folder and helped me stay on stage to be able to better use my time. Uh, besides, of course, taking care of family, uh, sending family home to Nebraska for a while, living out of a, a, a rental, and of course then work. All of those, I kind of built these little folders and I even put them in a little plastic case and carried them around at different times when I would go to different areas. But I have found that as more and more things are calling upon my time, if I say time out and build myself some folders, uh, it will really uh, help me in regards to that. Because <laughs> one of the things, what I'm never going to have more time in my life than I do right now. There's a story, and you've probably heard it, where you are giving a sum of money, $86,400. But there's a proviso with that. You see, you get $86,400, and that's deposited to you. But if you don't use it up in 24 hours, a withdrawal is going to be made. And your account balance is going to go down to zero. Well, start thinking about it. If you had $86,400, but it was going to be gone, if you didn't use it in 24 hours, how would you use it? Hopefully, you try to use it as wise as you could to do the best that you could. That's what time is, folks. That's what time is. You get 86,400 seconds in 24 hours. You're the steward of that time, and how you use it is totally up to you. I thank you for taking the time to listening to me today, because I know that you never had more time in your life than you do right now. And life and time are the two best teachers. Life teaches us to make better use of our time. And time teaches us the value of life. So with all the time that you have, I hope that you have yourself a brighter summer day. And know this, I'm taking the time to root for you. Yes, I am, because we're in this together. And I know there's others who take time 
and let's remember them. Because blessed are they who ease the pain of misfortune, for they shall be called insurance agents. Take care. Take time. And don't forget, you're round to it. Mm -hmm.